Hi, we are Pico Studio from Barcelona. We are Jordi and Alexis, and we are here to talk to you about our first game arrived, a simple story. The story behind Arise, it's a story that could happen to any of us. It talks about very universal feelings that everyone can relate to. We wanted to create a whimsical, magical, fantastical world for Arise, but at the same time it had to be solid, tactile. We drew inspiration from animes, from Studio Ghibli. We want the art to reflect the emotion as well, because everything we do in the game is to create a, an emotion. This is what we want the player to feel. So. What you have seen so far is very colorful because what we have shown is, is childhood memories. When we step into other ages, then you will see different art, art styles and different modes and different ambiences that reflect the emotion of that particular moment. Well, the main character is uh, one of the most important things in the game. We wanted to have, you know, stoic character. We wanted the slightest move of, of the body to communicate things. The man has no eyes and he has no fingers. And we try to, you know, to communicate with that. When you have a stoic character that suddenly express something, it gets straight to your heart. And when he moves, you know, it's for something. It's for some reason. And that's how we created the old man. Well, yeah, I think with David Garcia, we were very lucky to have him on board. He's very talented and actually he did al almost everything by himself. We just gave him very, very, very high level guidelines for every chapter. Like this level is about childhood and has to express the, the joy of being a child. And this level is about being a teenager and defying limits. So it has to have this emotion and this the thrill of being a teenager. David is a genius and, and it's great to see a genius at work. The only plan that we had is we told him we want a, a great uh, emotional theme, main theme for the game, and then we will, you know, change and, and turn this theme into different songs for each chapter. So the main theme of the game suddenly turns into a waltz, suddenly it turns into a lullaby, sometimes it turns into something dark, and, and he did all that by himself. I mean, he's the music composer, but at the same time he is the, the sound engineer. He did all the sound effects, and at the same time, he programs things in the engine. He did so, everything. He did everything. He, I mean, one, one day he will call and say, hey, I did level 5. We enter level 5 and it's all there. And it's all perfect normally. Yeah, so, the music, the sound effects and the scripting, yeah. is all, everything is there. So it's like, you have to look like... Yeah, incredible. One day you open the editor and just the level sounds, it's like, wow. It's magic. Yeah, it's magic. It, it was very easy and rewarding to work with him. Yeah. We'll do it again. Yeah. <laughs>